Hi everybody, good morning. Uh, I'm doing this uh, nice room from Tayakmi regarding this uh, Confluence CV 2023-22515. Yeah, really, I didn't expect this. is very dangerous. You get directly create an admin access to the to the portal. Uh, it's very high score this one because directly you become admin directly. Um, it's and all of this Confluence data center and co uh, and, uh, and Confluence server, all of these versions are affected. Tryhack may give us very nice one. This the, the installed version is here. This is the affected version. You can see now you can basically these simple tricks, uh, and then if you f uh, let's start with start the machine. <coughs> Like for example now you give us like if we check the setup, if I go now let me, let me go back to the setup, that's how usually when you start in a normal, I was surprised because most application when you install them, now because this one is going straight to the login, why? Uh, when running for the first time you will go to the initial setup which will allow you to configure some basic parameter. The initial setup can be reached by this 59 setup. If you try to access the initial setup after you have completed, you won't be able to go through the step again, but you will be greeted with a message saying that your setup process already complete. So normally this, I don't know why they didn't uh, make a system where you remove the installation file like in WordPress and something like that, I don't know what, uh, but in any case, this is a Java application, so, and then also they give us this, so we can try. So this, it's like this application has a lot of tricks of it. So if we go with the ID this trick now, we come back also to the login page. So we can also call getter and setter in action. I'm not sure, I'm not good in Java, so I'm just, uh, I will do the later on the, the Python script for p uh, the POC. Uh, He said we can also call get and set an action class by using your specified an HTTP parameter with a chain of attribute we want to get set. An example, if the login action class had a set ID method, we could invoke it via a following URL. So what we did here, we become an, uh, an account there. And then here's all the trick of the, the CV, how the... Because the idea is you want to to come to the application config and reset it to true because basically after the installation it's false so we, we tr uh, when it's a false so we try to uh, so so basically if you all if, if you analyze the code of the server and for action class you see an extent of the Confluence Auction Support class. So there is one class provided, and there is the next one application configuration. This is one that we are looking for. Uh, guess this object contains the application configuration, including an attribute that tells the Confluence if the initial setup has been finished. And I'm very surprised how they code this inside. Because it's, when installation is finished, I mean, you're supposed to have every, remove anything related to installation. I'm not sure if it's Java related things or something. So basically, they go to the next class, uh, this inheriting class together. Uh, so now, if we call the set setup complete false, we will effectively re-enable this initial setup, putting it all together. We can call that chain of get the setup by accessing the following URL. So basically that's how all of this, if we take this URL, this will effectively translate by x work into the call to, so we have the provider, the config and this, this is the, the, the key part. So if we go now here, well it did it yesterday, we're really surprised this, how dangerous this. So, server info action, bootstrap state of provider, application config setup, and that's where the danger is come. So, when you do this and you press enter, it says success. Now, when, when it says success, it, it means 
we we put this false so we're going back to initial setup now that we can access the initial setup once again let's browse system administrator start action so we can go to this so we already have this so if we go to the next one so we go setup administrator start action and guess what uh, username admin is already exist. I tried yesterday, so you can make your own. I can make the at local.com password normal confirm. It give you config system administrator next. So how dangerous this one? Setup successful. You can now start using the confluence. Happy about it. Let's start. And now you are admin. You imagine how how dangerous this if uh, if it was some and you are now, of course this is the our flag. But you can see how how dangerous this one. So if if you don't do update of this, it's basically you you, you finish. So the hacker can take take everything from you. So you can see now you already access the whole system. Let's log out here. Let's me let me log out quickly. Now what we're trying to do is um, the exploit script that using Python. So let's now try to use this one. Remember, we use now the first one. We use this. Now let's try use this uh, script in Python. Um, le let me get this exploit. Uh, where is it? Uh, download. Let me get my uh, terminal. Where is that script? It's exploit Python. Now, if we read the script here, of course, there's some uh, some parameter we need to make sure that we have them. You can see is using is creating these two username and password, and all of that. Let's let me let me go to the requirement and the syntax. Okay, let's let's get this requirement. Okay, le the installation is to st let's start first. Make sure that uh, we have the requirement install minus r requirement. Because I said there is some Python, uh, and then there is the normal mode that's what we use because one year old only we have. So we have Python. Python 3, I think. We should I use in Python 3? Uh, exploit normal target URL is this one. That's why our confluence is installed. Let's take the target URL. Now, the next one what's the requirement for the script? It said output file. Uh, file equal let's call it log.txt no model fire why he didn't install it So sometimes is he hitting this uh, try hack me attack box? It always this something wrong with Python. Something it's uh, they always have this uh, dependencies issue. I don't know why they get it from. Okay, that's the file. Which which person? Which Python we have here? Hmm. 
binary python uh, uh, why didn't also does not currently take into account all the packages The requirement fire. Why is not installing fire? City list macro pigeon model. Where is the fire one? He has fire, I think 3.9. Let's try 3.9. I think is uh, 3.9 Okay, now we got it You see three, uh, Python 3.9 So username Please patch, let's try that one Also is the answer for our question here Because it said uh, what's, What is the name of the user was created Is that one So let's test it uh, use a piece patch and then the password is password2 password use a key image so let's put let's see if this one work and we are in you see that's the account of the admin this is the one we created using this exploit you know the reset the first URL and then this one the second to start the action again so we have this one and then this one we created just now you can see this is a really really very dangerous uh, uh, CV the detection of it, there is a, there is a scan from Eric Winter, so you can, uh, this one can scan for it. Uh, what type of script? This one. It's a Python, you can scan for it if it's uh, vulnerable or not. The, the, all the vulnerability instance should be upgraded at least to one of the following versions as soon as possible. This one, the update version, so basically uh, is Confluence Server version 0.2 remember here it effect uh, 0.2 is here so we know uh, no, 82.0 82.0 is affected so from the advisory of of itself so it's effective yeah does a play mitigation action replace the of course not you always need to to update never say no to uh, oh, no, no you always need to update your system so it's uh, so basically this is the assume we have analyzed broken access control variability in Atlas, uh, Atlassian Confluence Server and Data Center uh, it's a really dangerous uh, dangerous thing here I think the, all this portal they need to have a system where if you install you need to remove any trace of reinstallation or something so so this is Python Python script and this one the so technique uh, that's a nice cool uh, cool things okay guys thank you very much and hope you enjoyed